it's here. Okay guys, we are back in the apartment. I have the box here, recording on both cameras right now. Uh, right there, over there, I have my Canon G7X Mark II, and right here, I have my Canon 80D. Uh, right here, on the camera, I have the Gorillapod, the Joby Gorillapod SLR Zoom. Uh, this is what I've been using uh, for the past little while uh, on my 80D. Uh, but the new line, the new line of Gorilla Pods actually just was announced a couple months ago. Uh, and I'd say one to two months ago, the new line was released. Um, probably like two months ago. It was like November or December or something. Uh, but today is February 27. Uh, and I got the Joby Gorilla Pod 5K. Um, I got the kit. It is the new version of the... Joby Gorilla Pod Focus. Very excited to have this. Um, I'm going to be using this on my ADD for the next little while. Uh, very excited. I like the new paint job that they have on there. And um, overall, I'm very excited to get this bad boy out and start vlogging with that particular Gorilla Pod. I love the Gorilla Pods. I think they're really cool to maneuver around and use for vlogging. Um, so I am excited to have the new line and be able to use the Joby Gorilla Pod 5K, which is the new version of the Joby Gorilla Pod Focus. Uh, very excited. That's what's in this box. Uh, now I'm going to go ahead and open this box. Here we go. And here it is. The big reveal. This is from B and H. Way overexposed because I'm right next to a window. You can see right there it is from B and H photo. Very excited to open this box. It came all the way from New York City, where we were living there in the summer when I was shooting the Danish Book Boys TV show. Now we're going to open the box and get inside and see what's in there. I actually know what's in there. From B and H. From B and H. Let me set that aside right there. As you can of course tell, we are in the apartment here in LA. Go ahead and open this. Oh wow! Okay, now, the big reveal, oh, this is heavy. Oh, wow, okay. Bigger than I thought it was gonna be exciting, okay. So, I now have the Canon 80D with the SLR zoom uh, from the previous series, uh, Gorillapod, and now this is the brand new, brand new from Joby, the Joby Gorillapod 5K kit. This is the replacement of the Joby Gorilla Pod Focus. Really excited to get inside. I'm going to set aside the ADD. Get that out of the way. Wow! Oh, I'm so excited. Whoa! It feels so nice, and I'm just feeling it inside the box. So look at this. This is the Joey Gorillapod 5K kit. I never owned the Focus because I thought it was too big and uh, people were saying that the joints were more reliable on the SLR zoom, so I kind of just skipped the Focus. Could the Focus take the Canon 80D on? Of course it could, but I heard that the joints were more reliable uh, on the SLR zoom, but what I'm really excited about is on this 
top of the line model. This is the most expensive Joby Gorilla Pod that Joby makes. The most expensive, biggest, most robust, ginormous, and strong Gorilla Pod that they make. What I'm really excited about with this one is the ball head. I love the ball head. Uh, the quick release, you can never make a mistake. Like with this, you can slide it out. Yay, it's super quick. But if you're holding it this way and you accidentally press the button, there's a pretty good chance that your camera's just gonna slide out and fall to the ground, which is pretty scary. So on this one, you have to tighten something. On this one, that was loud. On this one, you have to tighten a little knob, a dial, and I'll show you that in just a minute. Okay, I moved you guys a little bit closer. This is the Joby Gorilla Pod 5K. I'm gonna open it, take a look at it, and try this bad boy on the ADD and see how it compares to the SLR zoom. I'm really excited actually. I'm gonna set this right there so it's still close to me, but it's not in the way. So, got the knife, little tab right there. That. This comes up that way. I actually have two SLR zooms, one GorillaPod Action, um, three of the super small original ones. I have a magnetic one, I have a suction cup one, um, the SLR zooms I mentioned, and now this one. Now, when you take this out, little instruction manual, I'm now going to read it to you. Just kidding, that's ridiculous. This isn't a normal video for me to do, so hopefully you're enjoying this. Uh, I looked it up and there aren't a ton like this. There are only a couple, actually. Take this plate out. This little thing covers where the ball head goes. So you see, when you open this up, there's a little thing right there that you have to take out first. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this out, and here it comes. Wow! This thing is... This thing is a beast. Oh my god. Right here, you can see I have it out. Joby Gorillapod 5K. Oh, also I vlog with this camera in case you're curious and you've never seen a video by me before. This is the Joby Gorillapod 5K. This is a beast. Like, on some of the videos I watch and some of the pictures, it, they actually make it look smaller than it already is. So there's this ball head up here, which is the ball head 5K. I'm actually a fan of this already. It's really big. Wow. I'm gonna take off the ball head. Oh, also I recommend getting the ball head and not just getting the Gorilla Pod legs because the ball head's extremely useful. One thing is there's three dials. There's three dials on this Gorilla Pod compared to the Joby Gorilla Pod SLR Zoom. On the SLR Zoom model, there's only one dial. So you can see right here, right here, there's one, there's one dial, and it just controls all of it. But on this one, you have way more control over what you're doing. I love the red on the ball head. That looks really cool. Like, I love the black and the silver that was on the focus. Then if I unscrew this, and then this one, you can do just for panning. Oh, that's so cool. Unscrew this dial, and this just controls the ball head. Okay, so here, if you have the Joby Gorilla Pod on the ball head here, I'm gonna just go through the ball head a little bit more. This, I love this ball head already. On the particular ball head, like, this tiny dial right here, I'm gonna just walk you through the basics. I know this is an unboxing and just my first impressions, but I'm also gonna walk you through how to use it. So here, if you undo this tiny dial right here, you can just move this way for panning. You can move all the way around, and then you can tighten it back up. And then if you wanna just control the ball head, then you turn that, and it just controls the ball head. So then you, uh, okay, you want to put it into that position. That's pretty good. Get ready for vlogging and go. And then if you do this tiny dial that's next to the ball head, right there, I'm using my smaller camera because I'm actually going to show you a demonstration with my big camera on there. Right here, 
and on the ball head 5K, if you turn this dial right there, then this guy slides out. I wish this particular dial right there that you can see that's on the ball head itself, I wish that was a tiny bit bigger. I'm going to take this camera and I'm going to put it onto this one and attempt vlogging. Also, one more note. For this camera, on this Gorillapod, I would carry a coin. Like, I, I pretty much up to this point have always carried a coin instead of one of those screwdrivers, but I would carry a coin if you use the SLR Zoom. This is a very good tip. You see this? Where you would normally use one of those particular screwdrivers. I wish I knew what it was called. I just took a coin and tightened it every single time. But it was easy to take off, but if you want it perfect, exactly uh, where you're going to slip it in. If you, if you want it to be so that this is exactly there, then you're going to need to tighten it with a coin. But on this particular Joby Gorilla Pod, on this ball head, and I'm happy I got the ball head. This particular quick release plate. You can see right here, there's a little thing that you pull up, and there you can tighten it. So you can tighten it onto the camera. It's golden, it's so genius. What I'm going to do is I have my Canon ADD right here. I'm gonna put on the ball head. Okay, we are on the Canon 80D vlogging right here. Right now I'm on the Joby Gorillapod 5K kit. I have the legs and the ball head trying it out. I actually love this. Like the way the way that it is, like there's a there's a metally feeling to it. It feels great. I'm on my I'm on my wide lens right here. And I could just hold it really close to my to my face. I mean if I fully extend. That's insane. That's one of the widest like angles I've ever seen. And half of the wide angle, like it comes from, of course, the 10 to 18 millimeter lens that I'm on right now. But then also the Gorilla Pod has to be pretty wide. I mean, look at that. Isn't that just amazing? See both sides. <laughs> I'm loving this. It's bigger, way more robust than I thought. In case you're curious, I buy all of my camera gear myself. Uh, I get that money from like acting jobs and stuff. Uh, but this, this Gorillapod was very expensive. Just this 5K kit was $180, like an insane amount. I cannot believe that this, this tripod is $180, but it's worth it. I'm going to keep this, uh, $180, a, a bit expensive. Um, but it's definitely worth it. It's a great tripod and I'm going to use it. I mean, if you're on more of a tight budget, then you may want to consider like the Manfrotto Pixie. Like I have those, I, I have those mini tabletop tripods are great. I have right here that I'm vlogging with right now to get this picture and this sound. I have the Canon 80D body, a 10 to 18 millimeter wide lens. Uh, yeah, so that's that's what it looks like and then for sound for my microphone. It's a great microphone I recommend this like highly recommend this. It's a Rode VideoMic Pro Plus uh, And then I have a coiled cord that I got with it uh, And then Joby Gorillapod SLR zoom Which is what I used to use and now I'm gonna be able to say that I have the Joby Gorillapod 5k this whole setup is more than three pounds, like three, three to four pounds, something like that. So it is pretty heavy to hold out like this all day. But I will do it for this kind of quality and this sound and this picture and this and to make this kind of video. Uh, I really love the the end result that you get out of all of it. So I'm willing to hold it. So hopefully you enjoy these videos. <laughs> now I'm going to show you what the entire vlogging setup looks like. Okay, we are back inside. It's a bit of a chilly day, so I had to put on a coat. It's not super windy, but it's very cold today. It's like 50, 55, something like that, which I know in Seattle, where we're, where we're from. In case you don't know the story, we're here in LA. 
just for like two to three months because I'm an actor. Oh, be sure to check out my other videos. We're here in LA, and it's a very cold day in LA. It's a cold day for, or for LA. In Seattle, it's a lot colder. Like, today it's 25 Fahrenheit. It's like 25 today. Wow. We're back inside. I took off my coat because it's warmer in here. It's like 70 compared to 50. Uh, and here I'm going to show you the overall vlog setup. Here is my main camera. Here is my Canon 80D. I vlog with this all the time in case we're, unless we're in an airport or at the theme park, I'm always vlogging with this. So this is my Canon 80D. This is my DSLR. My DSLR, this is the Canon 80D body, 10 to 18 wide angle vlogging lens. And then right up here, I have my Rode VideoMic Pro Plus, which I love this microphone. This is my vlogging setup. And this is with the Gorillapod. Look at that, it's huge. So when I'm vlogging, that's kind of what it looks like. That's the action. So it's actually, it's big, it's heavy, it's a big, it's a bit of a monstrosity, but it is really, really good for vlogging. So look at that. So that's what it looks like. And this is what it looks like fully assembled. This is what it looks like when I'm vlogging. So it's big. It's $180. There's going to be a link in the description in case you want to buy it for yourself. Uh, great, great little tripod. In fact, it's a great big tripod it's a great it, it's a huge gorilla pod like here's the final thing size comparison this is what i've just gotten and this is what i was previously vlogging with like look at that it, in real life it actually looks a lot smaller it is incredibly useful and I'm very excited to have this and put it inside my camera arsenal. So that is pretty much going to wrap up this video. This has been an unboxing of the Joby Gorillapod 5K kit. Uh, it's very big, very robust, and I'm going to be vlogging with it from now on. Very excited. So videos past this video, I will be vlogging with this. Very excited. So that's going to wrap up this video. Be sure to give it a big fat like if you did enjoy this video. I did a lot of things here. I unboxed it. I compared it to the SLR Zoom. I gave specs on it. Uh, I showed you a vlog test. I showed you a comparison on a different camera. I showed you the full overview. Uh, so hopefully you did enjoy this video. Be sure to smash the like button and leave a like if you guys did enjoy the video. And be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any other content that I have. Uh, I don't normally do tech reviews, but I will be doing more in the future. I just ordered another thing that's by DJI, and I'm very excited. It's awesome. It's coming soon. Uh... Anyway, be sure to subscribe for more tech reviews and primarily more vlogging. I am an actor, so be sure to follow The Dangerous Book for Boys. Be sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, comment down below if you have any questions, concerns, comments. If you didn't enjoy the video, be sure to let me know. And also be sure to follow me on Instagram for updates on my life. I post everything there that I'm doing. I don't vlog everything whatsoever, so be sure to follow me down below on my Instagram page. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye. See you guys in the next one. I will see you guys later. Bye. Joby Gorillapod 5K. It's big, it's strong, it's very convenient. It's, it's a lot bigger than I thought, but I like it. This is my new vlogging tripod. End of the video.